Another first for SpaceX tonight, the Dragon capsule, the first ever reused private spacecraft, has returned to Earth after a month at the International Space Station. Now, the previously used Dragon capsule splashed down today, making a successful return to Earth. CBS 2's Elsa Ramon is live in Hawthorne tonight with more on this historic mission. Elsa? Yeah, pretty incredible, Jeff. It did spend a month in space, but it did make its way back to Earth today for a second time, making history for SpaceX. And as you can see, slowly moving away, Dragon released. At 1.41 a.m. Central Time, history was quietly being made high above the Earth. The Dragon capsule became the first to fly a second time to the International Space Station. And SpaceX is Dragon, the only cargo ship currently capable of returning uh, hardware back down to Earth uh, through a splashdown into the Pacific Ocean. As we slept, the ISS released its grip of SpaceX's Dragon cargo ship. After spending a month gathering crucial research finished by the crew on the ISS, Dragon floated away to return the 4,100 pounds of precious cargo back to Earth. SpaceX fan Conrad Pinheiro was impressed with Dragon's return. I would say, I would say revolutionary, perhaps. Landing legs have deployed. And the first stage is back. And impressed by the reuse of Dragon's launch vehicle, Falcon 9. Seen here returning to Cape Canaveral in Florida just minutes after sending Dragon on its latest mission back on June 3rd. It's a game changer, I guess. I think it's really awesome that somebody is a visionary like that. ISS astronaut Jack Fisher tweeted this the moment Dragon left the ISS. And there goes Dragon. Goodbye to our first return visitor since Atlantis in 2011. Come on back anytime. We'll leave the lights on for you. That's speed. Air winds, Dragon 11. And SpaceX did confirm via Twitter shortly after 5.15 Pacific time that Dragon did splash down off the coast of Long Beach. However, SpaceX will not reveal where it's going to be taken or when to unload all of that cargo.